guys. All right, so the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills season 10 trailer finally debuted after months of us waiting. Andy Cohen finally released the trailer today. And it's so crazy that I'm not really looking forward to this season, but I am at the same time because I'm not really a Beverly Hills fan. I always find these ladies quite boring, but I'm quite interested in seeing what the hell is going on with Beverly Hills. We have Brandy Glanville coming back. We have Kim Richards and we also have Camille Grammer. And there was rumors that Brandy and Denise um, are feuding. I, I heard that Brandy said that um, they had a threesome between uh, Denise's husband and Brandy. So I want to see how this plays out. Denise has stopped filming with the girls. Denise and Lisa Renna. I'm um, sorry, going back and forth on Instagram. Like so, so I'm I'm interested in this season, but at the same time, I'm not because this show really does bore me. Last season was just like, I, I watched last season, but then it, it just, I, I think I stopped watching maybe after episode seven. The Lucy Juicy Apple Juicy storyline drove me crazy. And I agree, agreed with Lisa Vanderpump, but leaving the show and uh, and refusing to film with the ladies because they were just trying to find drama for nothing. And I think that's what, why I don't really care for Beverly Hills because I, I actually do like all the ladies. This is a cast photo for season nine, by the way. I actually like all the ladies. And I think that the reason why I get so bored with them is because they actually all get along and they all like each other they all are not really vicious towards each other with this cast like in the past they have been but for this cast I think that they all really do really do love each other as friends and sisters and that's the problem with this show you can't really have women all getting along and expect good entertainment we the viewers unfortunately like to see fights and table flipping and throwing knives at each other these group of women, I, I don't really see them doing that because I, like I said, I really do think that they all love each other genuinely and they all do uh, support each other, which is how it should be. That's a, this is how, uh, this is how TV should be. That's how friendship should be. That's how the early 2000s reality TV show, remember the simple life where they all got like, people should be getting along, but us as viewers in the entertainment business, we want to see fights, unfortunately. Isn't that sick? That is just so sick. It's really sick that we want to see people fail and friendships fail. It's just, it's just, we live in a sick, sick world. So I am probably going to watch the first couple episodes. Well, it depends on this trailer. All right, so let's talk about this uh, cast photo. Um, it, I like it. It's, 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 it's popping. <laughs> They're, they were in bright colors. Um, I think everyone in here looks good. We have, okay, so Beverly Hills season 10 is making history. We have, they have their first Black Housewives on the show. Um, I know, I forgot her, I forget her name, but I know her from the Jamie Foxx show. Her name is Fancy from the Jamie Foxx show. Um, and then she also had her own talk show. It was a whole group of them. It was like, um, it was a Ross, the, um, heavyset, uh, gay guy, Ross and her. They hosted this, um, Hollywood, um, talk show for a couple of seasons. But, so I know her as Fancy. Um, uh, but everyone looks really, really good. I don't really, except for Kyle. I don't like those bangs on you, Kyle. Um, it makes you look, um, your age. Cause I, I, I am so surprised that you're in fifties. I found out, I found out, like, I think, uh, she turned 50 last season. I was like, holy shit, Kyle, you look, um, amazing, but the bangs make you look older. Um, but I always thought that you're like in your early forties, late thirties. Um, but the bangs make you actually look your age. Just get rid of the bangs and you'll go back to looking young again. Um, and everyone looks really, really good. I see the girl at the end, the one in the pink, she gained a little weight. Um, I don't like Dorit's bob. Um, and uh, I mean, I like everyone looks good. I'm just being really picky right now. All right, so let's dive into the trailer. I'm kind of anxious to see um, what these ladies are bringing to us. I hear that the drama isn't really all that good, um, but you know, Beverly Hills, they, they are, it's, it's a hit or miss sometimes. So let's dive into this trailer. All right, the astrology guy's here. He's pulled all of your charts. Kyle is Capricorn. What will get you the most worked up is when someone is being treated unfairly. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's weird. All right, Dory, when you do get upset, it's almost like a tidal wave. Kyle, let me finish. You finish. I'm not talking. I'm going to freak the out. Even if you want to hold it back, you say you can. Can I? What else should I do, Teddy? Oh, those are fighting words for me. That is some white people stuff. Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. How we roll? Well, that's Beverly Hills. I need to buy myself a car to feel better. My car's not. Don't get any feelings. I've never been with a girl. I've only been with a couple. Judgy Wuzzy was a pregnant woman. <laughs> Welcome to Rome. Yay! Woo! Now, couple by looking. Yeah! I hope it's not over. I love drama. 
I want to say thank you to my new best friends. Some of them, not so much. Oh, shame. Tate, you were a little boring. <laughs> Are we supposed to be honest or not? You were an asshole on Twitter. I was going to dish it out what I got. So fancy. You the sh if I have a goddamn ice sculpture. As long as you feel good about yourselves, look in the mirror and own it. Yeah, mother I'm facing myself. Can you? Do you really want to go there? Come see about me. I don't give a Oh. Denise, there is a side of you that is hidden. Oh. She's not who she pretends to be. Oh. I don't deserve this. That is a huge thing to f***ing say. What could be that bad? So the If you don't want to be here, then go. Don't try and destroy my family. What if she's manipulating me? You sent a cease and desist? Who told you that? Oh, you're so angry. Oh! What? <laughs> Why did that give me chills? <laughs> think I'm gonna be here for season 10. Hi, Hija. All right, my dog wants to say hi. Every time I film, I tell you guys should be used to him right now. Every time I start talking to myself, he wants to hop on my lap. He's like, Daddy, don't talk to yourself. It's okay to talk to yourself. What the hell was that trailer? It looks so dark and good. All right, season 10, Beverly Hills. I, I, I might actually watch a full season this time. You guys might have my fucking attention. That, what Lisa said at the end, oh, you're so angry. Like, what? <laughs> ah! The villain, it just came out of her. I wonder if they, I wonder if they were just pretending. I wonder if that was actually real drama. Because, you know, sometimes they both are actresses, so maybe they were, like, reading off a script. Because I can't... I, I, I wonder. I wonder. All right, so let's dive into this trailer. So I, it looks like Denise is going to be the bad guy. I guess that she has a lot of inner secrets that she doesn't want to let out and it looks like don't you dare bark at me no no it's not time to play no no so it looks like she has like a lot of deep, deep inner secrets that she does not want to let out and it, it, you can't do reality tv and have secrets you have to oh, Aisha, my fucking god stop you can't do reality TV and expect um, some things not to come out because you know, they're going to find out some things, Denise. When you signed up last season, Denise, I think that you should have um, really thought about signing up for a reality TV show because you you can't have secrets while on the show. You can't. Um, so I'm kind of interested in seeing her demise and fall. So It's so sick of me to say that. Like, I don't like to see people fail, but it is entertainment. I, I feel bad, Denise, because I do like you. Um, but I actually didn't really think that you're good for the show, but I like your personality. I think you are a good person. Um, Lisa Renna is back to being her messy self, messy boots, messy Renna. Um, it's always good TV. Erica Jane, I guess that she's going to be feuding with, uh, Denise Richards as well. I actually r really stopped liking Erica Jane. I don't know, something about her. She's not as fun as she used to be in the first season that she was on and the first couple seasons she was on. Um... And I still don't care for Dorit. I, I don't care for her. And um, Teddy, the one at the end. I, you know what? I said she gained weight. I didn't know that she was pregnant. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't know she was pregnant. I thought she just gained weight. Uh, I never really got into her either. So the last three people I'm not really into, Kyle and Lisa and Fancy and Denise, I am interested in. And I'm inter interested in Brandy and uh, Kim Richards. And, oh, and Camille. Camille, why, did they, why don't they give her a, 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 di a diamond? They need, she needs to have a diamond. So she do, she pretty much carried the whole entire season last season and the reunion last season. If she was not on that reunion, the reunion would have been boring. If she wasn't in the finale, the finale would have been boring. Denise needs a freaking diamond. And she said that she actually was not asked back for season 10. But because of the lack of drop, stop it. Stop. But because of like the drama for its end, the producers asked Camille to come back, and she said that if they if they need, if they want um, people to be entertained, then it should be diamond holders. And she feels like she should um, hold a diamond, and I agree with her. And it looks like she's feuding with Lisa Renna again, and possibly the girls. I just stop. 
All right, so are you guys looking forward to the season? Are you guys gonna watch the season like I am? Comment below and let me know what you thought about the trailer. So The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills season 10 premieres April 15th at 9, 8 central on Bravo. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video. Please subscribe to my page if you haven't already. And while you're on my page, check out my other videos and let me know if you agree or disagree with anything that I said. Down below in the description area under more markets, I put my Instagram and Twitter information. So go ahead and follow me guys. That way you can send me a DM for any video requests that you have. I can't wait to talk to you all again. Bye guys. <laughs>